I am fat and fly as fuck, not ashy as fuck. That is not my brand. Hello, my loves. Welcome back to another episode of Fat and Fly as Fuck. Today, we're gonna tackle another subject that a lot of you have been asking about. We are gonna talk about stretch marks, or as Chrissy Teigen calls them, stretchies. First of all, what are stretch marks? How do you get them? So a stretch mark is basically a scar that happens to your skin when it gets expanded, stretches too quickly. For some people that happens with weight gain, it happens in pregnancy. They even happen to people who are bodybuilders who are getting like, you know, real buff. And if you happen to have an increase in cortisol, which is the hormone that is the stress hormone, you are more likely to get stretch marks. The most important thing to know about stretch marks is that everybody has them. So not only is it normal to have stretch marks, it's normal to get stretch marks everywhere. They start out dark because they are a scar and just like scars, eventually and over time, the skin cells regenerate and they start to lighten up. The next thing that a lot of people wanna know, how can I prevent stretch marks? One key to preventing them is to stay hydrated. If your skin is hydrated, it's gonna be stretchier, which is great, because y'all should be drinking water anyway, because water is like a shower for your insides. Get them all clean, clean your insides, get them all clean. Some folks swear by creams and oils, different lotions. I use a Palmer's lotion, not for stretch marks, but just because I like Palmer's and I like not being ashy. I don't necessarily know if this is gonna help with stretch marks. That's not what I use this for. I use this so that I don't have to deal with this. Oh, who ain't ashy? I ain't ashy. What? Some people swear by scar creams like Mederma, which is a cream that people use to lighten the appearance of scars. They even have a special stretch mark cream. And people swear that if you use that every day, it helps them get make a lighter appearance. I don't know if those work any better than just using lotion, hydrating, taking care of your skin, but some people say that those work. I know another thing that people like to hear about is how could they get rid of stretch marks if they chose to. One option you can do is laser surgery. Now what a laser surgery is going to be good for is if you have the dark kind of stretch marks, you can get the laser surgery over them and they can make them lighter. Me personally, I'm more of a rock what you got kind of person, but I'm never gonna surgery shame anyone. It is your body. So if your stretch marks are already light, if they're white or if texture is a thing that you don't like. There's a special kind of laser called the fractional laser therapy method. <laughs> I sound so smart. So what that does is I guess it, it leaves like little injuries in the skin. So it'll do a thing, leave untreated skin, do another thing, and then the untreated skin helps promote skin cell turnover in the skin with stretch marks, and that helps it so that those fade quicker and kind of go away. So like I said, with stretch marks, you're welcome to do whatever you wanna do. It's your body. If you wanna try to get rid of them, if you wanna see if you can lighten them up, it is all about what you want and what you feel comfortable with, but everyone has them. See y'all, ain't no shame in the stretch mark game. Everyone has them. If you would like to talk about how you are learning to embrace your stretch marks and all of the parts of your beautiful, wonderful body, please do so in the comments down below. Thanks once again for hanging out with us at Fat and Fly as Fuck. I'm Danielle, and we'll see you soon. Bye.